get a driver's license and a voter registration card? The Arizona House is calling for an amendment to our state constitution to lower the voting age from 18 to 16 years old. Cronkite News reporter Amber Kawaji spoke to one Valley teacher who says this amendment has his vote of yes. Amber? drive a car, get married with parental consent, and even be tried as an adult if they commit a violent felony or a double murder. But there is one thing that they can't do, at least not now, and that's vote. 21 is the current age. For these students, voting is just another day in the classroom. We're going to use our remotes on this. You guys ready to vote? That's because Maryville High School teacher Barrett Nitschke believes the youth need to be heard. Every age group has their own perspective about uh, what the, the country should be. And perspective is what his students receive when they practice voting during class hour. But those votes submitted moments ago don't count. However, this could change if HCR 2046 gets passed, okay. lowering the voting age from 18 to 16 in state elections. All you need is a simple majority in both the House and the Senate to pass the amendment along to the voters. There, it only takes another simple majority, 51% of the voters to approve the amendment. Though some may feel 16 is too young to have the power to vote, Nitschke thinks otherwise. 16, 17 year olds pay about $9 billion in taxes every year, but they don't have a vote. So the whole country was based on no taxation without representation, so why not them too? If I was given the right to, I would definitely go out because I wouldn't want this right being wasted because if the government of the state thinks that my age group is capable of that, then I would definitely help and be responsible for what decisions could be made. One of the main reasons people agree with lowering the voting age is because they believe it will help with the voter turnout of the younger demographic. The 18 to 29 year old age bracket has consistently remained the lowest group to go out and vote, staying between 20 and 40 percent of the voter turnout range. In Phoenix, Amber Kawaji, Cronkite News.